Hello, we're back. And this time we are invading the Reach. I declared war on him. Um, I feel like, you know, we're, we're going to be, you know, we're going to be a little patient when it comes to invading uh, the Yeedy. Because they are... They're kind of a pain. And they're dealing with the revolt. And I'd much rather um, just go in and just dunk them all in one fell swoop. When they're at full strength, because I want to fight everyone when they're at full strength, because it kind of gets boring picking on people when they're weak. And uh, invading the Yidi is kind of, it's kind of obnoxious because of the supply limit in some of the places. And getting everyone over there on the other side of the world. And uh, right now is also the perfect time to invade uh, Westeros because half of the kingdoms are just gone. Um, I mean, I guess there's also... The Iron Isles, but who cares about the Iron Isles? Well, they, they can just stay there. I don't want to move them around. Except, I may, I may eventually go over there just because I really would like their fleet levies. Because we got all of our men in one, yeah, in one giant fleet of a thousand ships. And we're going to go uh, take them down. Which shouldn't be all too hard because they haven't actually tried to defend themselves. Our grandson... Prince Daemon, uh, you know, one day will become the uh, emperor, or the king. Yeah, he'll be the emperor of the True Valyrian Empire. And, uh, you know, egg's not hatching, he's four, that's no problem. Another thing um, that's good is that since I have absolute realm authority, um, my vassals can no longer independently act in our wars so they don't get the temporary independence which means that this guy over here this girl day oral over here she cannot usurp our title because she will never be independent because when you get the temporary independence for some reason the game will let you usurp a title just because just because the game just feels like that and uh yeah Let's, let's get to it. This should be a pretty easy war. I haven't seen... I mean, they got like 2k men over there, but I don't care about them. And uh, land all the men. Smash them all in one go. Bam. There we go. And we're going to go straight for High Garden. We just got to go sail our boats up there. Stream. Our uncle died? Oh, which uncle? Is it... Are you... This guy? Is he dead? No. Baycar's still going. We One of our... One of Orion's sons is still alive. King Makar. I think, isn't he a twin? No, not that I can tell. It must have been this guy that had twins right as he died. Yeah, right here, we've got brother. Yeah, we got him. All of our brothers and sisters are just dead. I don't know how they all die so much. Like, you're dead. You just died recently. In a trial by combat. Of course, because why not? But we got our son. And there was a specific name requested for, I'll, and I'll, whenever you have a son, I will, because, uh, someone already requested, also requested, uh, the name Daemon, and that's already there, so. We'll worry about that later. We got an invasion to deal with. Oh, our wife is sick. Well... Yeah, and now that we have our concubines, we actually are getting more kids. Vomit, explosively vomiting. Dang. That is intense. Get the struggle. Yeah, you're already getting the struggle. Oh, wait, never mind. You already had a kid. You had a, one last kid at like the age of 47. Whew. Dedication. Oh, we have a daughter. Who's inbred, apparently. Cool. Oh, is uh, 
Another dragon? Is that our dragon? No, just the same sprite. Where are our boats? No, our boats are right there. Okay. Can I move you guys any further? Whatever. Yeah, make our... Go do it, buddy. Our wife died. Who cares? She's a secondary wife. I guess we can get married again. Um... We'll get married to you. Here we go. I should have married someone actually famous or whatever. Wow, that's all you have to defend against me? High Garden has nobody to defend it? Apparently, or whatever that was. Okay. So we need to split this off. You guys go to Cider, Cider Hall. Uh, They're gonna take a lot of attrition. Okay, so this is our uncle. This is a dragon rider. Apparently he abdicated. Oh, look at that! That was fast! Um... No, I'm keeping the money. I'm already a tyrant at this point. There you go! No, uh, that was fairly easy. We can just send all the men down. And we got like 40k men that we can raise from this guy. We just let it go. Um, no, I'll judge his family. Uh, issue. Should we? Let's see here. We're a family person. Um. Is that your son, Peter? You already have a big family. Getting them out. Nah. Well, we'll let them live in peace. I'll throw you in jail. Uh. Now we're throwing you all in jail. Like you, I'll call for your trial. Cool. Someone rides a dragon into battle. Oh. Who do we get to choose for our... No, I'm not gonna ransom everybody. Uh, I could. I'll, I'll ransom you. I'll take your money. Come on, buddy. Okay. So if we go... No, you, you stay where you're at, dude. Uh, what, what happened here? Dude, Makar, you lost your land, buddy. Come on, man. Whatever. Just stand down. You will stand down. I will take your land. Oh. Okay. Then I will imprison you. Oh my god. Whatever. We'll do it with you in a moment. Shouldn't be all that hard. She has, like, no men. Uh, but what was I gonna do? Yeah, first, I was gonna check here. And if I raise your men, you got- you give me 37,000? Oh, yes. That is amazing. You just continue going on conquering Westeros, because it's so easy. Except if I go for the Stormlands right now, they're in a pact with the, the Dothraki Sea. And that'd be kind of a pain to fight both of them from both angles. So we may just go take more of the free cities after we take the Westerlands, of course. And taking uh, these guys. I kind of want them to just settle down. But... Or we could wait, because I need your guys' boats. I need I need your boats. But uh Hmm. I got you. Can I revoke your land? No. 
Okay. Hmm. Let's, let's think here. Well, I'll have to just wait. Uh, most of that stuff is just pointless. We'll raise all the vassal levies. Yeah, she has, like, no men. And, uh, raise the boats. I got the manpower. I just, here, I'll raise my boats, too. Okay. This should be, like, a really easy war. And I'll, I'll let all the men raise, because we're in a defensive war, so... Oh, you already? No, you want white piece? Hell no. Apparently we won that war. We won that battle where we were, like, outnumbered. By, uh, by quite a bit! So we're coming for you, Karth. Who are you? You're defending against multiple... What? You give me a hundred bucks? Yeah, you can avoid the whole trial thing. You, though, you cannot. Oh, Killigon. Who's gonna... came to Killigon? Hopefully Killigon will heal. Okay, so it's not... There's a different sister. That died. Lord Veyron. Cool. I got my boats. Where, where are my men? They're over here. Okay. Hmm, we got open council position. Uh... You get someone who's loyal to me. That's all that really matters. I'll go lead that with you. And you! What do you want? I'll go see. What, what faction? You're of independence? Well, you're not nearly big enough to do anything. Plus, I have dragons, and you don't. So, uh, good luck doing anything. Be that guy. Oh, buddy! Oh. Yes. Come on. There we go. Uh, why is there always a sickness over here? Who, who are you? I'll grant you a favor. I'm not giving you land. Sorry, buddy. Uh, no, we really do. We can increase the speed. Jeez, we just like lost half our men there. Oh, buddy. Oh, well. Oh my god, I'm not even. S Wait, no. She changed her capital. She doesn't even control Karth anymore. What are you? You are a failure of a leader. Oh, buddy. Well, we lost all of our men. All the men sieging have died. But none of them were our men. It's not that bad. And just throw it in. No. Okay, we'll go fight these guys. There we go, I can siege that land. Oh, look at that! Did you lose Karth? No, you just lost some other duchy. Okay. Uh, yeah, I can imprison some people. Could throw you in jail, but this is 1%. Like, this is not worth it. You're a dragon rider. Cool. Uh, it's too late for you to get married. Oh, well. Someone will take your dragon when you die. Ravenous. Cool. Both. So the real question is, how are we going to take Karth with the sickness? Um, you can you can keep your little name naming privilege. Yeah, call for a dragon rider. You, I want to call you. Oh, your Lord Paramount. Okay, uh... Can't take your land. I honestly just want to take your land. Oh well. We get seek sickness, or treatment for sickness, but... At this point we've just lived, we've learned to live with it. It's 
part of us. Oh, a previously obscure man successfully tamed a dragon. A random guy. Oh, he's Valerian. There you go, man. That's a weak claim. It's not very nice. I don't want them to have a claim on my lands, but... And it's They're not really... In, none of them are threats. To my dominion. Oh, you're gonna ask for money, aren't you? You're gonna do it. I inherited that. The Summer Islands. Okay. Uh, let's go find someone in my family. My family. You! Why not, Vakar? Or nephew? Be a king! Yeah, have that. And then really be a king. Bam. There you go, it's yours now. You can keep it. Of House Tisdale. Cool. I'll count that, even though it's technically not a, a cadet house. I like to think of it as one. You want to be legitimized. Um... I mean... But I don't even have the option normally. Yeah. Why not? You'll be legitimized. Oh, wait. You got legitimized to Sunglass. Look at you. And you're Riverman. You're an Andal. Uh... How did he get that? Mom is High Valerian. I mean, how did you even get that culture? But I guess it's not that bad. Because we got the ha the sun the Sunglass family name under us. And we know that there is absolutely no chance that guy can uh, go toe-to-toe -to -toe with us in a war. Because he can't ride a dragon. Well, chances are he can't ride a dragon. I somehow have to get more men to go siege Karth. That, that is... Hmm... Let's get these guys... This is gonna be an annoying, an annoying war right here. You guys are all under me, right? No. I have to go take the Targaryens out. Soon. Whenever I can be bothered to do it. That, that is when I will do it, but... Okay. But we'll, we'll go siege their capital. Because there's no sickness in her capital. That's not Karth. Yeah, there we go. Bam. Uh-huh, deploy my dragon. There we go. We'll siege it down. Leader's not here. Oh well. Got a mild winter. Don't care about that. Clapping you all. There we go. Bam. Gross. Okay. Let her ban the neat. No, you will. You will forfeit Karth. There's nothing you can do about it. So now that I have Karth, it's my land. I want to destroy it, but I need 40k prestige. Can I just keep Karth? Can you just take another kingdom instead? Because I need 40k prestige to destroy that. And there's no chance I'm going to be able to get 40k prestige. And anyone I give it to will just immediately become uh, not futile. Well. Guess we may have to just put this off until next, like, later. Can I just give, like, someone else like you... What happens if I give you the city of Karth? I'm kind of scared to do that. I think I'd rather just sit, live with the really weak ones. You go here. Yeah, you're relatively weak. We got you. You don't even like us. None of you even have the same religion as us. But, uh... Hmm. Yeah.
Yeah. Pick all your land. There we go. We, we got her land. So we could actually go and give this to someone. I don't think I have anyone, period. Yeah. Our family's not all that big. Could I at least get someone who I'm, like, related to? We already have kids. Um, you never got married. Like, if I go to one of you people... Like you. You're kind of related to us. You know? You're just like a, a little... Cadet house, you know? So we'll give you... This land. Matsar, uh-huh. Yes. The Holy City of Karth. Awesome, there we go. So he has it, and his... He is feudal government. That is beautiful. So no more different uh, different government. I could try to do the same to these guys, but they have never uh, they haven't revolted against us yet. Or at least if they have, I, I totally forgot. That's good. So we've got the reach. And the next stop is probably these guys. Probably you. The Lannisters. Oh wait, did you guys change? I could sworn oh he just came of age recently. Okay, well that that's one more down. You still have you no longer have your pact. So I could easily go just walk over there and take you over. Get the boats. Cause honestly, out of all of the three kingdoms, the ones I kinda Oh, there we go. Yeah, I think I have the men, because we already got tons of boats. I think I got even more boats. Yeah, from uh from the reach. Is really good. You're yeah, you're Lord Paramount. Uh could kill you. Can't exile you, can't send you to the wall. Why can I not? Was not captured in battle. Hmm. Okay. He'd like us a lot more, but he hates us so much. That wouldn't do anything. I don't know what to do with you. What I do need to do to you is I need to take Dorn from you, man. Can't hold both of those. So maybe you could. Another thing about it, maybe maybe I'm fine with that. Because I'm going to have problems with Vassal Limit. That I'm going to have to address relatively recently, which I may just do with this. May just, you know, adjust the council. And then after I do that, I can just stick a bunch of loyalists over here. Yeah. Got people who love me. Or I could uh, try to get a character with more diplomacy. Dude, you're never going to adopt a lifestyle. Just get that. Okay, so yeah, I think I'm gonna leave it there. One more kingdom down. Uh, we we got more power. Oh god, the the horde just the the um, Dothraki sea just exploded. So if we go over here, Dothraki sea, someone just oh no, you got thrown in jail, and you're a nephew. So you, who who do whose jail are you in? And this guy, the savior. So they lost that war with those guys. Go do some colonization, but that's good. So yeah, I'm going to leave it there. And until next time, if you like the video, you can leave a like. If you want to see more, you can subscribe. And until then, take care.